Hi everyone! Welcome to the Pony Code AI rap battle at GitHub Satellite. You've maybe seen rap battles in real life, but here today we're going to take it into the virtual world. We're here for an AI powered rap battle that pits the PonyBot, an AI rapping machine created by Pony Code, against a real human rapper, Larry Charles, coming to us from the Bay Area. My name's Elisa Chen, and I'm the CEO of Pony Code, the proud sponsor of today's rap battle. Please allow me to introduce you to our rappers. PonyBot is an AI powered rap lyrics generator created by Pony Code. In our day job, Pony Code is your AI partner for coding, allowing you to create, modify, and visualize unit tests in just a few clicks on our simple AI powered interface. So maybe you're hearing this short description and you're asking yourself, what does Pony Code have to do with rap? To be honest, not much, except that our team is made up of people who love hanging out and listening to rap music and love data science and coding. So this is what naturally comes out of our coffee breaks. Let me also introduce you to Larry Charles. Larry is a Connecticut born video game developer with a knack for clever wordplay and all things creative. Larry has graciously accepted our challenge to go up against the machine, but more on that later. So here's the download for the session today. First, we're going to start with Edmond, one of PonyCode's founders and a super data scientist who will tell us all a little bit more about how he created the PonyBot, the PonyCode wrap generator, and what it does. Next, we will train the PonyBot to generate rap lyrics based on the hundreds of suggestions that you've sent in, thanks, and you'll get to peek at the code as it learns. Then we'll move on to the rap battle. I'm obviously biased, so I'm going to hand over the rap battle to a neutral referee. We're going to have three rounds in the battle, with the PonyBot going first in each round, followed by Larry, who will follow with his own brilliant lines. During this rap battle, you'll have the opportunity to vote live for the PonyBot or for Larry as they rap away, and we'll crown an ultimate winner at the end of this event. You can vote by going to the Twitter page for PonyCode. Our handle is at PonyCodeDev, but you'll see that on the bottom of your screen a little bit later. And, and then voting on the poll that we'll have running there. For those of you watching from home, which I think is most people today, we wanted to be honest with you and let you know that we've pre-recorded part of this event, since we're all in different places across lots of time zones, but I reassure you that the voting and crowning of the winner will be done live. So now I'll hand it over to Edmond, super data scientist and PonyCode co-founder, to tell us a little bit more about the PonyCode rap generator machine and how he created it. Edmond? Thank you, Elisa, and hi, everyone. My name is Edmond Awad. I'm a data scientist and one of the co-founders of PonyCode. I grew up in France in a family of engineers. My mother is an engineer, my father is an engineer, my aunts, my cousins, my brother, my uncles, all engineers, everything about number in my family. Even my cats become very strong in arithmetic when it comes to counting the keyboards in his plate. No need to tell you how hard it was for me to write my essays in school, to fire all my neurons just to write a bunch of sentences that resulted in barely passing grades. Some kids in my class wanted to be astronauts. Others wanted to be president. All I ever wanted was some kind of robot to write my essays for me. So six months ago, my girlfriend told me I never wrote her a poem. Obviously, it was one day before her birthday. So I grabbed a pen, a piece of paper, and put on some French rap music to put myself in a romantic mood. That was the moment I realized I was even worse at writing lines than, was, than when I was a kid. And why a poem? Poems are not fun. My past was coming back to haunt me. Why couldn't she just ask for some rap lyrics? And that's when it struck me. Everything in my life had led me to this moment. My love for rap, my job as a data scientist, and my hate for writing. I was destined to solve it, right here and right now. So three hours and three jigs of data later, I got my first AI rapper generating thousands of lyrics. Needless to say, I never could finish that poem. To be honest, I didn't even finish the first sentence. So I showed my girlfriend the rap, the rap lyrics. And, and then she was my ex. But in a very <laughs> weird and selfish way, I felt very happy because I had fulfilled my destiny. And today is the day I share my masterpiece with you. 
Okay, let's go for the tutorial. So I've prepared the Google Collaboratory Notebook, accessible by anyone, with the codes and tools for this generator, in case you want to try it at home. For those who aren't familiar with Google Collaboratory, it's basically a shareable online notebook where you can execute your codes cell by cell in Python. It's basically the Google Doc of Python code. For the AI wrapper to run, you first need to prepare your environment. I have made the PonyBot code open source on GitHub. All of you can clone it. Also, we will need to install the Markovify package that will be used in the first step of the AI pipeline. C CD to the wrap battle folder, run the cell to download the NLTK packages. And don't worry if you don't know these packages. You don't need to know how they work to understand how the AI was built. So before we train our models, we have to prepare the data. Let's create two folders. One folder for the artistic mode in the artistic slash data folder, and the other for the freestyle mode in the freestyle slash data folder. Click on refresh to see the new folders. Click on wrap battle and then on artistic. Click right on data, upload and select all your lyrics. The upload is quite fast. The data does not stay more than a few hours or a day on collaboratory. So you may have to repeat this process. Let's do the same for freestyle. Click on freestyle, then click right on data and upload your, your lyrics. Okay, we are good to go. So let's create a PonyCode wrapper instance. And now the training on artistic modes can start. As you can see, I am loading the data from the artistic slash data folder. To make it faster for this video, I've only put 100 sentences and state size of two as parameter. So if you try this at home, I would advise putting at least 5,000 sentences and a state size of three to get really quality lyrics. Don't forget to pass the parameter mode as artistic. The training then takes about five to 10 minutes for a thousand songs. So let me explain how the artistic model actually works. First, it uses the Markovify package to build a Markov chain. Markov chains allow calculating probabilities for sequences of words. The way it works is very simple. So we give the model a list of sentences and it learns which word is more likely to be followed by the other. For example, if I give the model the sequence of words, I and like, then it will predict a next word. For example, rap. So I gave I and like as input and it predicted rap. The sentence generated is I like rap. If I give as input, what is your, it will suggest name. What is your name? So many companies use Markov models for completion of sentences. The higher the state size, the better your model will keep words in memory. If the state size is equal to two, the model will take into consideration the last two words to generate a third one. If the state size is equal to three, it will consider the last three words to generate the fourth one. However, I don't advise you putting a state size greater than three to avoid overfitting. Because of course, the higher the state size is, the higher the meaning of the sentence that will be generated, but the higher your probabilities of repeating a whole sentence already written in your data. And in the end, just making an algorithm that repeats your data sets without any kind of intelligence. So once the Markov chains are, are set up, PonyCode generates the number of sentences you gave as a parameter. Here, the sentence number is 100. And I would advise you to make at least 5,000 to increase the variety of your lyrics. Then what PonyCode does is uh, it creates order out of the chaos of the 5,000 generated uh, sentences. It creates an order where sentences are paired, are grouped by rhyme. Obviously, 
uh, any algorithm that creates um, order from chaos is very costly. And if there are some heroes, heroes among you who want to contribute to make this training faster, then, then it is the first place to look. So when you will, when you generate lyrics, Pony Codes will pick pairs, groups of sentences that rhyme, and make a paragraph following following a rap pattern. So A A B B, A B A B, or A B B A, and each paragraph will follow one of these patterns. Okay, now that all the training is done, it's time for some fun. We can generate our first lyrics. Here, in the parameters, I have put n verses equal to 4 to make the Ponybot generate 4 paragraphs. I will not read them for you for this time, since you will see plenty of them in the battle. But let's make a quick analysis. So we can see an A-A-B-B pattern with the rhyme in E, so B and me, and one with a rhyme in apps, so caps and wraps. And all the other paragraphs are following the expected pattern. Thank you all for your attention. I really enjoyed sharing the Ponybot with you. Don't forget that the repo is open source, so you are free to use it and contribute. Thanks so much for that, Elisa. We are so excited to have you and all of the Pony Code team here. And we've got this amazing Pony Bot here, which is based on a whole bunch of crowd suggested songs that heaps of different people from the community have been putting in through our online forms. It is like the secret source of everything that's been happening. It's creating all the fun that you're gonna see right here today. Now to give you a little bit of idea about how this pony bot has been trained, we've got some fantastic lineup of all different types of song genres. We've got old school songs. We've got some French and even German rap. I'm very excited to see that, let's just say that. And then we've got anything from Hamilton Music and so, so many other different genres. So you can see we've really trained this bot on a whole range of different music and different songs. So it can give our human competitor a really good run for his money. Now, speaking of our human competitor, we have Larry here, who's going to battle this amazing AI bot. So Larry, welcome. Tell us all Thank about you. yourself. Oh, hey everybody, I'm Larry Charles. I'm a video game designer by trade, but I love creating rap music, writing raps, and just battling whenever I get a chance. So thanks for picking me to do this. I'm excited. Oh, I'm so excited to have you here too, Larry. So let's get right down to business. Now, the first theme of the first one we've got coming up is man versus machine. So as they rap, as they battle, we've got some polls happening over on Twitter. So we want you all, yeah, you, to go on over to Twitter and vote for your favorite rap battle artist. Is it gonna be the man or will it be the machine? Human versus robot, who is gonna win? I'm so excited. Let's get into it, woo! Now Ponybot is gonna take us away. They're first up onto the stage. So take it away, Ponybot. We're going to be around. So, take what you found. I'm the future with a bunch of weight every time I log in. When the walls fall around you is when you will know when to begin. I have never seen you, but I know you're not the only one messing. But I want to be loved by digital witnesses. What's the point of doing anything? In 77 and 69, revolution was in the air and a finger to the sky. I call you. You don't call me just to tell me. People giving up just to scream your name. People lining up just to give the blame. Air-conditioned TV land, 20 grand walk to the summit at night. You and I are meant to be. Somebody cuts me down to the sea. Yeah, I'm an analog man in a digital world where they've given me. I once had friends, but I can't feel it inside. There's no place to hide. I hit you with a hard hand, you know, that I leave it alone. You're so clever with all you proceed. I stare at my phone. And the voice said, this is the inspiration I need. 
Okay. We were meant to be. If you need a boyfriend, please don't mention me. Because even though this is man versus machine, I'm going to make you feel like scouts versus marines. No doubt in my regime. So please let the king reign. But now you mad, baby boy? Well, I'm Ving Reigns. I'm King James coming down the lane with a fast break. You don't understand. Just go rewind. Play the last take. And man, they tell you, where is your crown at? Hopefully not the same place your source code was found at. If you had eyes, you couldn't see me, dude. If you had hands, you'd really want to be me, dude. But you're going to probably see me on TV, dude. And I know you got fans, but they're spinning your CPU. Me losing to you, ha, never. That's a bad look. It's bad enough they got me rapping to a MacBook. But now what I'm doing now, just cooking up a verse. And when I drop these bars, I bet it mega hurts. Because right now is the time like it's man delay. I'm going to be the one who leaves with his hands raised today. I came to stay and slay everything in your database. So go ahead, your streams will compare to mine, your second place. And if you're first place, well, that might be so. Just remember when it comes to code, you got to start from O. Yeah, and that's word to your motherboard. Y'all gonna watch me roll on this machine like a hoverboard. What? That was insane. Whoa, not bad at all, Larry. Let me just say, I'm impressed. Now, audience, are you impressed? Don't forget to go head on over to Twitter where we've got our polls. You can vote live for Larry or Ponybot for round one, man versus machine. Now we've got round two coming up right now, and it, the theme is quarantine. So, Pony Butt, are you ready? Yoga pants, sweatshirt on the globe, I'd rather be. Strong words in the dark, you were born to sing the blues. Now it's time to lose. Strangers waiting up and run, and I had to go steady. Put in them hours, I'ma make it right so badly that I always got it wrong. Living in a ghost machine. Soon there won't be long. And oh my little quarantine. Yoga pants, sweatshirt on the globe I'd rather be. And it's a long hard road until I can keep on going all the world, as we know. And I get locked up, they won't let me out, no. If you don't wanna see lad broke he grove empty. I just wanted to get along. And now we are awake, and it seems too much for me, it always came too strong. You symbiotic, patriotic, slam fight, bright light. You may say, that I'm a wild light blinding bright. He starts to make it better together, we make a wicked pista plate. It's times like these that we activate. Yoga pants, sweatshirt on the globe I'd rather be. Strangers waiting up and run, and I had to go steady. <clears throat> Listen. You're lucky they got us quarantined and sheltered in place, because if it wasn't for quarantine, I'd probably be up in your face. Wait, face? Wait. I'll save face because I'm trying to save face. Because I'm missing all my parties and weddings from save dates. Running out of food, eating the same meatloaf every Thursday, but I still do my best to stop the curve like a first date. Remember using LimeWire back in 02? Well, that should probably help you understand what the humans are going through. Half the people living scared, nobody wants to touch, and all we have to do is stay at home to clear it up. For some of us, it's working, but a lot of us aren't working, and no one knows for certain when COVID will catch the curtains. So, you, know, you feel me? If you hope you understand all these lyrics and puns, but if you don't, I can break it down in zeros and ones. One day, it was zero people. Now it's a lot. And if we don't want it to be worse, we just got to stay in our spot. Survival of the fittest. Yeah, that only works for individuals, but we're supposed to be one nation, indivisible symptoms invisible living through it is miserable and opened up is in our best interest I mean, maybe for the principal a team of pro teams that need to be defeated so you don't understand we just want it all under control eh? then delete it get out of here larry you're tugging on my heartstrings oh. here you're making me well up this is absolutely insane now don't forget the twitters the people you out there listening go over vote for larry vote for cody code whoever you want to vote for put in your votes or take in all those discussions and all those polls in on twitter now are you all ready for our very final round it's round three of the github satellite virtual 2020 Pony Code AI Rap Battle coming to you live right here, right now. And the final round theme is Rapper's Choice. Pony Code, are you ready? Your monologue's getting tired. Now it's time to cut the dead weight. You can't even invent your way out of a pastry bag, understand me? Giuseppe's when I step in this place, and I'm still too great. Wait, till they get a taste of what this battle would be. I run the streets, really? Your track sounds like a little piece of celery. 
contact was blown by Benzetta and the source to cause a little controversy. I changed the weather in the whole country, but they ain't caught nobody. Or talk about the fact you were insecure. Whether things are good, they're great, and it's like I'm running against a cheesecake. Is I don't see her. Way too much quiche, what else does it take? I'll take Maxwell's super hammer and give you something to smile about. They don't want to see me on the streets alone for a sec. Look at you try to pull the camera out. Sean Kingston got robbed, and now you missed that check. Yeah, a breath of spring. That's what I call one abs. Counting money, you know how we living. Herzog and Adidas, man, you know I'm like the dream team touring overseas. Now you are going to be successful, you have to rain on my parade. Now this is the last time your music got anybody made. Wiley, lay off the fries and egg yolk. You can't do fast food half as good as Biggie and Pack joke. Alright. Let me wipe these tears, I was laughing too much. Alright. Listen. I sat through three rounds of your trash and I'm still on my feet. You might have a career as an app that puts people to sleep, especially if they've been up late. So go ahead and take every rhyme that I've said and add it as an upgrade. You need guidance. No, you need silence. How'd you get here? Did you pluck strings on violins? <laughs> I thought you would kill the solo like Kylo Ren, but this is a marathon and you died a mile in. My flow's contagious. I'm known for rock and rapping stages. Your flow is trash like plastic. It should be wrapping packages. Go get some rapping practice in, then keep practicing. <laughs> I kill a mic like kill a mic, thought you should know that. Because every flow you study from a song we call a throwback. You're one step away from being a Siri update. You better download some new rhymes and we'll get upstaged. Your team is up for days and what they did is very impressive. But I have to say they didn't believe that you would leave get invested. You're an investment, a product of brilliance. They left an impression. The only mistake they made was asking me to test it. Boom! Mic drop! Whoa, that was nuts! I definitely can say this has been one of my most favorite rap battles ever to watch. It's been so, so cool. All right, now we have coming up next the results of this wonderful rap battle. So while we're getting those results in, don't forget to put in those last minute votes over on the Twitter feed, the discussions. Head on over there, put in your last minute vote. So we have to thank the amazing team at Ponyco, namely Edmund and Elisa. Thank you so, so much for all your fantastic work in programming and coding and doing all that great work behind the scenes so we could hear from an amazing AI program. I think I had such a great time. I'm sure all the audience had a fantastic time as well. Elaine from GitHub, thank you again for pulling all this together and being so amazing, coordinating it all. Thanks for Chris and Tim from MCW Events for putting this entire thing together. This has been such a great experience to have all of GitHub Satellite online, virtual, freely available for everyone around the globe. It's been really, really amazing. We want to thank every single person who put in song requests in order to train the AI system, which we thank you again so much. We want to thank everyone for putting in their results because without you all voting, then we have no winner. And last but not least, we definitely want to thank Larry. Thank you so much for all that work, that effort you put into doing your lyrics and that heart felt emotion that you put into your songs as well. We just want to thank you so much. It was such an amazing pleasure just to sit here and listen to you battle against our rap. Hody Code rap battle is such a cool experience. Here are results. Let's bring them in. Well, the numbers speak for themselves. They do not lie. Congratulations to Larry for winning the Pony Code AI Rap Battle. Your heartfelt emotion and effort that you put into your words got across the finish line and just shows that people really value human connection and human connectedness during this fantastic time or this crazy time. I would say. So thank you again for being here and congratulations on winning the Pony Code AI rap battle for GitHub Satellite Virtual 2020. Woo. Yeah. Woo.